Alrighty, hello there. It's, I think, Wednesday, someday late in August. I don't know, August 22nd, maybe, 2018. It's now 8.43 p.m. up here in northeastern Ohio, and we have a moon that uh, is still hiding in the trees. And it's difficult to see, but Saturn is there in the cove of the trees. And Jupiter on the other side of the willow. And down in the west-southwest is Venus. But since we're over here already, facing this way, let's go over to Saturn. Alrighty, I know we have a really grainy image here, but I wanted to crank the ISO up so we can find Titan, the planet Titan around the planet Saturn, <laughs> in our mini solar system. And it looks like it's over to the uh, 4 o'clock position. Let me lower it somewhat. It looks like shit that way. can barely make it out, but it's still there. And... Okay, and here we have Saturn rising in the south-southeast. It's not coming in too bad for the weird weather we had today. A lot of rain. So far, we're able to see all three planets here and, and the moon. Neptune, I believe, is uh, above the horizon somewhere. And there we go with our look at Saturn. Okay, let's now head over to Jupiter. Actually, I'm going to do this. In the lower right, we see uh, Venus, but at the moment, we're shooting for good old Jupiter. And again, we can see the stars of Libra down there out ahead, down below at the bottom right. Aren't those honking horns so irritating? <laughs> oh my. I am glad when they shut them off quickly. Alrighty. <laughs> So three of the moons of Jupiter out in the lead, and I believe it's uh, Europa out in the back. As that mini system is descending for the night. And... But so we have Saturn in the uh, Sagittarius area, and Jupiter is over in Libra. Not sure where Venus is, but. Boy, those bands of Jupiter are having a hard time coming out tonight. I can barely make them out. It's so blurry. Well, that's a bummer. It's not coming in very well. But we'll let the big guy settle down for the night before heading over to Venus. And if the pictures come out alright, I might try the overlay again. I do enjoy it. But if it bothers you guys, let me know, please, and I won't, uh, I won't put a background sky image in there. All right. There she goes for the night. Okay. And over here on the west, southwest.
We have Venus about to take its nighttime nap with its half moon phase. And our moon is still buried behind that dang tree. <laughs> oh well. Every angle I tried to get it from in the yard, front to back, I couldn't uh, couldn't get it. But there she goes. That's the tree that's giving me headaches right now. <laughs> and the one that uh, Mars likes to play dodge in. It's actually down there also. It's probably down about the 7 o'clock position of the moon. I can just, uh, every once in a while, if I move my head, I can see a bit of orange. But 90% moon there. Saturn. Jupiter. And Venus. There's our trio so far. Alrighty, I hope to be back and maybe even have some moon footage too. We'll see. Alrighty, we're back. Uh, guess who just popped through the other side of the trees? <laughs> Whoa, did you see that? Probably a bird or a bat or something, but that was cool. <laughs> Anyway, we have a 90% moon now with Mars over to its left, Saturn over to the right. And after it gets up into view, we'll go in. Okay, the planet pictures were taken with a cannon and the moon is being recorded on the Nikon P900. I am so hoping that the P1000 just uh, takes care of all my needs so I don't have to tote all this equipment around. We shall see. <laughs> Alright, we'll take another trip around the moon like we did last night. Oh, wait a minute, what is... Uh, that area looks odd for some reason. Looks out of place. Um, let me center this so we can... Right in the middle of the screen, there's a. Huh. It's hard to see the one round crater, but it looks like a starburst of a blurriness around it. I don't know, it could have always been there, but just uh, caught my eye. And I can't visit the moon without going over here to our mesa and our beam crater and a question mark. <laughs> oh. Whoa, hello there. Okay, as I was just about to say, we can't forget about our numbers and letters there and that uh, <laughs> bird or whatever. Bird bat flew right over it. <laughs> Anyway, that should do it. Boy, it sure is bright white to the eye here. With again a huge uh, rainbow ring around it. And you know what? I just might be able to get Mars if I get up on the rocks here. I'm hearing some bangings I don't like. Yay! Alrighty. And it's 9.19 p.m. And by going on the other side of the willow tree, we finally have a Dodge of Mars, I think. Unless it's a damn star. <laughs> I shouldn't be. Let me, uh... Already, it's not telescope quality, but there's our orange buddy. 
Over in the southeast, below the moon. It's about damn time we got you again. So tonight, instead of three, we have four lovely planets. Woo, almost fell over on the rocks. <laughs> ah, not good for an old lady, you know? And there he goes. And there I go for the night. All right, and I think today's Wednesday, so maybe August 22nd. 23rd, we're around there somewhere. It's 2018, I know that part. <laughs> Alrighty, good night all.